hello everyone welcome again back to my channel so today's video i'm going to be making a black soap a glowing black soap for you know for adults okay so why i said adults is because i made the previous one for for kids it's right in my channel kids glowing soap especially for kids and this particular one is mainly you know only for adults you can use it if you are 18 years plus it's also very safe and natural before i go further if you are new here like this is the first time to this channel you are welcome and do not forget to subscribe remember to turn on the bell also notification bell so you'll be notified when i upload videos okay so the black soap i have here is not up to half this is quarter i want to show you guys how to make this using just this small amount of black soap okay if you want to make full wrap it's always in full wrap but, but i've made from the black soap and this is what is remaining and i'm going to show you the right quantity of ingredients to add to this little black soap i have here all you have to do is just to keep washing and please watch this video to the full so that you see how to make this soap and the benefits i swear so here is organic black soap nothing is added okay i'm going to start by adding all the powdered ingredients first the first ingredient is ascorbic acid it has lots of vitamin c which are great for the skin so the black soap is not up to half i'm going to add half tablespoon of ascorbic acid the next ingredient i have here is orange peel okay you get it from the orange the back of the orange and i'm going to add one full tablespoon of orange peel this is great for exfoliating the skin it gives you a brighter skin and a very lovely glow and the next ingredient i have here is citric acid so this is so so very very important because lots of people develop acne pimples from black soap i don't know why but me i normally add this into my black soap when making it i don't use this for kiss okay. this is a little bit strong though it's a mild natural acid okay i only use it for adults when i want to use it it helps a lot to exfoliate this is a half tablespoon of citric acid and just this amount is okay it will help you to get rid of your pimples rashes for those that develop allergies from black soap, this will help to clear it off, remove eczema, remove wrinkles and fine lines. It's going to give you a youthful skin and brighten your skin as well. The next one is this red powdered ingredient, calm wood. I'm going to leave all the ingredients in my description. So yeah, I'm going to add half tablespoon of calm wood. Okay. Sorry guys, I'm supposed to use my measuring spoon. Calm wood will help to give you a smooth skin, purify your skin for a brighter look. It removes impurity from the skin and rashes, any skin problems. So it's very, very good. The next ingredient I'm going to add is sulfur, sulfur powder. So this is optional. So this, I'm going to add it in small amounts. This is one teaspoon, one teaspoon of sulfur this will remove rashes skin problems you know sulfur contains antibacterial antifungal properties that will help to give you a very smooth skin get rid of skin problems is optional and i will never forget to add my turmeric powder this is a very good ingredient if you want to achieve a glowing sweet skin this will give you a glowing skin a smooth clear and a purified skin okay I'm going to add one full tablespoon of turmeric. So guys, I'm through with the powdered ingredients. So this soap is mainly for a glowing skin, a neat skin. Next, I'm going to introduce you guys. The next one is the oily ingredients. Guys, you have to be careful when adding oils into your soap, you know, so that it can lather well. If you put so much oil into your soap, it won't be able to foam. So guys, I'm going to add my carrot oil. 
this is half tablespoon half tablespoon of carrot oil i made this carrot oil myself i have the video on how to make this carrot oil right in my channel in case you need it you can check it out okay carrot oil will give you a very glowing skin it will prevent or delay signs of aging when you make use of carrot oil in your black soap you have a healthy skin a glowing skin plus you won't age fast so the next ingredient i will add is lemon oil it glows the skin and give you a brighter skin okay this will brighten your skin in case you have a dark skin so i'm going to be adding one tablespoon of lemon oil how can i forget honey honey is the power ingredient okay it's going to give you a glowing skin like your skin will just glow even if you don't use this soap every day you will achieve a glowing sweet skin i'll be adding three tablespoons of my honey this honey is very very thick so this is three tablespoons after adding the oily ingredients the next thing i'm going to do is to use my hands to mix it very well assuming i'm making a lightening soap or whitening soap i'm going to wear hand gloves because it's going to give me dark knuckles the ingredients here will not damage my you know my knuckles mix it very well I'm going to add guys glycerin one teaspoon of glycerin is okay or a few drops my preservative I'm going to add one teaspoon as well the next thing to add is my fragrance this will make it to smell very good, to have a very sweet smell. Half tablespoon of fragrance. If you can add any type of fragrance, banana, strawberry, apple, different kinds, vanilla. I'm going to mix it again. After mixing it, I'm going to transfer it into a clean container like this. This quantity will last me for two months. Yes, I use it morning and night. Okay, it will last me for a very long time. Here we have it, and this will give you a glowing skin, a clean looking skin, like no spots, no blemishes, no pigmentation, no wrinkles and fine lines. You won't have any pimples, acne or any other skin problems. This is very, very safe and natural. Do not forget to subscribe to my channel if you have not. Turn on the bell so you get notified when I post new videos. I have so many videos on my channel and I have so many videos I will post. Okay guys, thank you guys for watching. Do not forget to give this video a thumbs up, okay? I will see you next time. <laughs>